My name is Steven. I work as a project manager for Loop. So I handle all the sewn products, it's garments, uh, boots and uh, packs. We have our office here in, in north of Sweden, in Jämtland, uh, quite close to the ski resort Åre. It's quite interesting area where we live because the, the Atlantic Ocean is only through a two and a half hour drive from here and the Gulf Stream comes in so it, uh, the temperatures can vary a lot. And the nature up here always has something to offer and it's up to us to gratefully accept it. You go to bed in, in the evening and it's 25 minus, you wake up the next morning and it's two degrees warm. We've all chosen to have our base here because of the closeness to the nature and uh, the closeness to the environment in which we want to test our gear. It's a good place to, to live because you have like, you have a super big major testing ground just outside the door. Riding sled dogs and you're alone on the mountain, then the, that's the opportunity you have to f really free your mind. So normally I come back home from a, a trip and I can have like three or four new ideas. And that's also possible to apply to, to fly fishing garments. Working with Loop is uh, interesting because it's a very specific target group uh, and they know exactly what they want. Fishermen's environment is really the, the ultimate challenge to dress really. It's like no, nobody should be in wet and cold you know because it's really hard to dress. So that also gives one other aspect on how to design the, the garments and what materials to choose and so on because uh, one, two, three plus degrees and wet is super bad combination. It's easy to dress in 30 minus if it's, if it's dry. It's harder to dress in 3 minus if it's wet. I think uh, working with colors um, around fly fishing, I, I take my inspiration from water. And water picks up all the colors of its surroundings, the sky and the trees and uh, what's in the water. So you get like a very wide range of different blue, greenish colors that you can work with. Um, and that's where I started out when I started um, picking out colors for Loop. Now, I've never worked on a project where there's been so much wear and where it still has to be 100% waterproof. So that's, it's a, it's a really big challenge, but it's also really fun to try to come as close as possible to, to perfection. I know lots of brands, they, uh, they have like these lab tests or they create a wind tunnel or something and we've got like the whole valley as a wind tunnel. <laughs> It's a good place to, to live because you have like you have a super big major testing ground just outside the door. Mm -hmm.